And Bauer, four and two with a 376. I told you his last start in Oakland, seven innings, he allowed two runs, but they were unearned runs. He did not allow it. Only two hits. He did not get a decision. He left tied in that ball game. But in his career, he's had his issues with the Oakland A's. He's one and three and seven starts, so he's going to try and get the ship righted here tonight. Hit in the air right field. Oscar Mercado will pull it down. One away. Here's a high fly ball to center field. And Leone Martin will grab that for out number two. Swing and a miss. He struck him out with a fastball at 97 miles an hour. Chris Bass has started first time since 2015 against the Cleveland Indians. A couple of starts that time, but uh, Scott mentioned pitching extremely well. The previous five starts did a great job, especially in Detroit. The record of two and one picking up the win there. Frankie Lindor batting left handed steps in to one pitch. Swung on hit high hit deep to right center. It is going gone. Francisco Lindor with his seventh home run. Six of them left handed and the Indians take their early one nothing lead on a towering blast to the seats in right center. So Lindor homered last night and tonight he hit it about as high as he hit it far. The base is loaded with one out. That's the deals. Swing and a miss. He struck him out. Chased it high, and that's a huge strikeout. Grounded to short. Marcus has it. He throws to second, and Bassett works hard. He gets out of it, but there was one run on the Lindor home run. It's good to see Chris Davis in the lineup. Yeah. Asked Chris today about you know, your sides bothering you. When when does it bother you the most? He said just just when I swing my hardest. I just can't swing as hard as I. I'm used to doing for Chris Davis. It's a little bit of a tentative swing. Lindor has it. Lindor throws across, and that's the first down. But you're right. It, it, it it's still Chris Davis sitting in the yeah. middle of your lineup. But I'm sure he's a little frustrated because you yeah. you can't really let it go. The A's try to take advantage of some wildness from Bauer, much like the Indians tried to against Chris Bassett. And now here's Fegley. Bauer kicks and deals and he misses badly and Fegley walks and that's going to knock in a run. Three walks in the inning. And Semyon on a curveball grounds it to short. Lindor drops to a knee. Gloves throws to second for the force and Trevor Bauer did minimize the damage. Now the wind up and the payoff pitch. Swung on drill to right field. Back goes Mercado. He jumps and made the catch on a dead sprint on the track in right. Oh, what a play by Mercado. Racing back on a dead sprint. Leap on the track. Snagged a rocket. Boy, there aren't many guys that could have made that play. Mark Canna now is going to be in, and this is a big story right here, as Mark Canna is going to pitch hit for Chris Davis. And what does that tell you? Chris Davis continues to not be right. 1-2 offering fastball hit into right field. Mercado back to the track, to the wall, and it is gone. The ball just kept carrying for Mark Canna and the Athletics. will take a 3-1 to one lead. High fastball on the outside corner, and Canna just got the barrel on it. He Chris Davis the pitch is what he did. <laughs> Fastball up and away, opposite field home run. That's the Chris Davis M.O. One down, here's Carlos Santana, walked his first time up, and it's swung in and hammered. High, deep to right center, gone by Santana. And the Indians get another bomb that way. Number eight for Santana, tops on the club, and the Indians now trail it three to two. Simeon is going to have a two out double and they're going to do it. Chapman drills a single toward left. Simeon will come around to score easily. Chapman's going to try for second and he is safe as the ball squirts away from Kipnis and it's four to two. Leonis Martin draws a free pass. Here's Oscar Mercado fly to deep right his first time up. Mercado blasts one up the alley in left center field. That'll go to the wall. Martin around second on his way to third. Sawbar going to wave him home. And once again, the Indians cut the gap to a single run on Oscar Mercado's RBI double. 4 3 Oakland in the sixth inning. Trying to win their fifth in a row. Fastball weakly at right back to the mound. Knocked down by Bookter. Slowed down. Barehanded by Profar. Throws to first. Great grab on the bounce by Matt Olson. What an outstanding play by the Gold Glover. As Profar charged in, grabbed it, threw quickly to first on a bounce, and it didn't phase Olsen one single bit. Profar 
been hit a couple of times. Here's the 1 0. Swung on and drilled deep right. Pro 4 unloads and out it goes. A rocket off the bat of Pro 4. A loud long ball. His seventh of the year. And the A's gained some insurance. And they now lead it 5 to 3. So two away. Here's Lindor. And he got him. Pitch in the dirt. Trinan strikes out Lindor and a nice clean bottom of the ninth inning for Blake Trinan and he gets his ninth save and the A's stay hot. They have now won five consecutive games. They're five and two on the road trip and they are just one game under 500. Time.